man, uh, take responsibility. Just be accountable, not just for yourself, but for all of the young men that are coming up. That's the message Maurice White is spreading. It's a challenge to other men to step up and be the example young boys need. If we have more people out there contributing to society, again, our society would be better. But also we have to be mindful of what it is that they are contributing, you know, to our society. Is it something fruitful or is it something that's going to be negative or acidic to our community? Celebrating 70 years, the Boys and Girls Haven has provided guidance for young teens who may come from a troubled family life. They arrive to this facility on Goldsmith Lane with very little trust, faith or structure. One thing that I learned specifically working with this demographic is you have to be not only dependable, but you have to be consistent. And if you say you're going to do something, you have to make sure that you follow through with that. Something that takes a long time to build, but only a moment to lose. Trust and reliability is a key element to the success of these young boys. They don't even have a vision of obtaining something successful or having that experience of success. So, you know, it's like I have to almost show them, like literally, like you can be this before they can even identify the thing that it is that they want to be. Maurice White knows the struggle all too well. He graduated high school with a 1.9 GPA, but even then, one person believed in him and changed the trajectory of his life. It's what he tries to do now with students at Boys and Girls Haven. Gloria Gates, uh, she was my academic advisor, and she just wholeheartedly believed that if I had an opportunity, I was going to roll with it, roll with it and just go for it. Some say the only difference between the haves and the have-nots is opportunity. It's opportunity that Maurice White is providing to these boys as a way for them to write their own path to success. I've seen a lot of guys get out there and really take advantage of the opportunity and be fearless, you know, of the unknown. Because they don't know once they, what's going to happen once they get out there. But the only thing they can do is take everything that we've tried to instill in them here and apply it. It just goes to show that all it takes is one person to inspire another's faith and trust in the process, no matter how your life gets started. In Louisville, Stefan Diggle, WLKY News. Boy.